We are a financial research company. What makes us different? We buy the stocks we recommend with our own money. So, how did we do in 2018? Let's have a closer look. What you see here as a blue bar is the value of our portfolio at the beginning of last year. And you see again in purple the value today in January 2019. No matter what currency we look at, we lost money. 13% in Swiss francs alone. That's almost 50,000 Swiss francs. That's devastating. Had we done nothing in 2018, we would be 50,000 francs richer. Should we stop investing? Many people do. After periods of losses, they just exit the market. But that means you're losing out on the good years too. And it's impossible to just stay in the market for the good years without the bad years. I hate losses too. So what do I do? I look only at the entire investment period since the start. Let's do that now. What you see on this graph is in blue the total amount of money that has gone into my portfolios. I invested four times 100,000 Swiss francs. You also see the value of those investments today as a purple bar. And surprise, it's positive in all currencies. Even in Swiss francs, it's up 3,102 francs. In addition, it's always important to look at different currencies. When we look at Euro or US dollar, the portfolio is up 30% and in British pounds even more. Now Swiss people, Swiss investors, may think that doesn't matter. They need their money in Swiss francs, but that's not true. A lot of the money Swiss people use actually goes into imported products. So the performance in other currency is just as important. Remember, look at the entire period of your investing. This is more accurate and more likely to be positive. Also look at your performance in different currencies because other currencies are just as important.